Grand Bahamas Tea Connection set to a parent concert. The concert is one of a few remaining events planned in honor of the country's 40th anniversary of independence. Peter Adderley says music lovers will be in for a treat on September 13th. We're hoping to pay tribute uh, to these great Bahamian talented sons uh, who, who helped put us on the world stage, on the map uh, for music. And so it's where Johnny Camp would have started out, where the Tea Connection started at Gombe Park. And for those who are not in a position to afford uh, $150 or $200 ball tickets, they too get an opportunity to see the Tea Connection uh, members while they're here. Natalie says the music industry was at a high point at the time of independence, and the Tea Connection concert is one way of reminiscing on the growth of the music industry over the years. Grand Bahama, uh, during the 70s and 80s, was the entertainment mecca, I dare say, of the world. And the Tea Connection, the late Wendell Stewart, Sonny Johnson, uh, Frank Penn, uh, were a part of what made uh, Freeport and by extension Grand Bahama and the Bahamas the, this great entertainment mecca. And so we see it as an opportunity uh, to have corporate Grand Bahama come out and celebrate, but also to ce celebrate what was uniquely Grand Bahama, great Bahamian music. So that's September 13th, the Gombe Park, the Tea Connection Concert.